Danny to leave on the count of three. Say goodbye, Danny. Bye. One, two, three. Goodbye, goodbye Danny. Danny. All right. Now that Danny's gone, I can tell you the good news. We have got somebody famous here at this show. They are an expert on something. They, they have discovered and or invented something. And then we're talking about Danny. What has Danny discovered or invented? Something groundbreaking. Sorry, twerking? A twerking machine. A twerking machine. All right. Uh, do you know what twerking is all about? Yeah. <laughs> What's it talking about? Yeah. Yeah, what does the machine do? It's a machine. It's a, machine. It's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a robot that twerks? A twerking or is robot. It, does it teach you how to twerk? A robot that teaches you how to twerk. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> a robotic twerking instructor. It's all the same thing. All right. On the count of three, let's say welcome back, Danny. One, two, three. Welcome, welcome back, Danny. Danny. Situated, and we'll, we'll begin the interview. Uh, great to be here. Really, really happy to be here. Uh, let's just jump right into questions. I know I'm a little bit late. Uh, yeah, right in the front row. Uh, my name is Twelve Fillings from uh, Mechanics <laughs> Monthly. Does it use some sort of hydraulics to get it going like that? Uh, we've got more than just hydraulics. We've got aeronautics. Wow. Uh, there's air powering the rapid motion back. And forth. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hi, um, Eric Rections from uh, Gyrations Monthly. We just want to know how does it stay intact when it moves so fast? Oh well, we've we've done extensive tests to maintain gyroscopic integrity uh, throughout the revolutions and motions it goes through. Uh, we've done deep space testing, underwater testing, you know, this thing is rated for all moisture levels. <laughs> back. Hi, I'm Bruce Hilda. Uh, I'm from the uh, ballet uh, union. Uh, while this is not necessarily in our wheelhouse, I'd just like to re you respond uh, to the allegations that you're going to perhaps make us all lose our jobs. <laughs> we love those little children. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's a definite possibility. I'm not saying I'm going to put you out of work, but we are mechanizing things at a rapid rate. Uh, yes, in the front again. Uh, Sergey Wilkins from the Google official newsletter. <laughs> If somebody wanted to learn how to do this, why wouldn't they just watch YouTube videos of it being done at that award ceremony? <laughs> uh, that's, that's a great question. Um, people could use YouTube, but we like to think that the services we provide are more than just visual stimulation. Uh, they, they're, they're a teaching and learning method that's really hands-on. Obviously. Okay. Hey, uh, Lamarcus hung from stereotypes. <laughs> Does it come in white? <laughs> no. <laughs> we applaud you, sir. Uh, in the back. Uh, hi, my name is Kyle Mathers. I'm from Twanksgiving. I, I, I feel like maybe I'm in the wrong press conference. Uh, but how does this go with uh, Cranberry Twelish? <laughs> This might be a very odd question. <laughs> Poorly. Poorly. I think you're in the wrong place. I might be in the wrong place. <laughs> uh, yeah, that over on the side. Um, Charles Carruther III, I'm the attorney for Hostess. Uh, we have a pending lawsuit against you based on the name Twinkies, and we wanted to know how you respond to that deposition and allegations. Uh, I mean, I can't make an official statement. Uh, my lawyers will speak to you after the interview, but uh, I I'm confident that the hostess brand and us can, can reach some sort of agreement, uh, hopefully uh, something that, that involves uh, free giveaways. <laughs> Hi, I'm, I'm Porn Dexter Williams from the Matrix Fan Fiction uh, blog. Um, sure, they're subservient to us now, but who's to say they won't all rise up and slay humanity? And force us all to, to dance in provocative ways. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing really. Uh, we've we've planned for just that scenario. <laughs> our R and D department is hard at work to create sentient, sentient versions of our <laughs> In the back. 
Hi, I'm Al Finkelstein. I represent Cyrus Botics Incorporated. Uh, we were trying to get in touch with her lawyers, but the number you provided us was wrong. Can we have that again, please? <laughs> Cyrus Botics <coughs> Incorporated. Cyrus Botics. Um, we are suing you for patent infringement. We just need your phone number for these. <laughs> I can get it later. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know the phone number offhand. In the left. Um, hi, uh, Charles Tool from Asimov's Three Rules Monthly, <laughs> and we wanted to know how do you respond to stealing the phrase "shake it like a Polaroid picture." <laughs> uh, we did not steal it. That's it's, it's a common phrase. It's 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 something that would be. Absolutely ridiculous to say we stole, they stole it from Polaroid. Uh, I, before we move on, I'm, I'm just going to uh, say we have very limited time. I, I really do need to get back to, uh, you know, finishing the, the last adjustments to our prototype Twinkie sex toy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, right. I'm Steve Jobs from the Nether Realm. <laughs> The software running them is entitled T Work. <laughs> is this the Codan software you're using? Oh no, Satan, I'm coming back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Billy Bob! Uh, sorry, Billy Ray! <laughs> A lot of embarrassment. Oh, no. Plus, she ain't much of a teacher either. No, no problem. I, I am. Listen, our our mechanical twerker. Yeah. She ain't much of a teacher either. Our mechanical twerking instructor. <laughs> 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 